This is the watering tool. It's actually two components that are sandwiched together. We have the watering tool top half, which is the base that hooks into the universal tool mount. So the magnets are mounted on top of here along with some electronic screws for verification. This is a machined piece of Delrin with laser engraved uh, text labels. And then the second component is also a machined piece of Delrin, which is the uh, watering nozzle lower half. So when this is mounted on the universal tool mount, the water source will come into port three and normally it would spray out in a very concentrated stream. And so we want to diffuse that so that we don't damage our plants. That's what the lower half is for. The lower half is very much like a, a shower nozzle and it diffuses the concentrated water stream into many smaller streams so that it's a gentler spray on your plants. So these two components fit together and they're screwed together with the same screws that hold the magnets onto the tool. If you'd like to modify the way your FarmBot sprays water, you can modify this component here. You could 3D print your own or machine one uh, on a lathe or with a, a CNC mill. And so you could maybe modify the whole pattern to better suit what you're trying to accomplish. Maybe you want more of a curtain of water, or maybe you do want a concentrated stream, in which case you could maybe remove this entirely or even make just a single hole that's even smaller. So whatever you wanna do as far as watering, you can do that by just modifying this one component. And to do that, you'd wanna look at the tech specs and download the 3D CAD model or the 2D drawing of this part from our documentation hub so that you can make a component that will fit in here just the same. In the future, we anticipate injection molding these components to help bring the cost of the farm bot down over time.